So a strong start, essential for both teams here as they look to head towards the knockout stage. Well, Peter, both of these teams will take to the pitch with a three-point focus. Ambition is fresh and strong. And each will want to go deep into the competition, so neither will be looking to come out of this with a, a flawed game plan. This has to be assured and close to their best. So that's got things on the way. Who do you, Jim, see making a difference here? Well, Peter, someone I see as being a well-rounded forward is Alvaro Morata. You can expect a, a lot of balls into the box when he's... Le Massive leap! All denied brilliantly! Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Second corner now. And it's Koke. Well, from experience, I can tell you, he'll get a lot of stick for getting that one wrong. Barisic. Now it's Orsic. He's a sharp little ball here. Orsic. He's left his man. Well, he had a really good run at goal there, but the defence just weren't going to let him past. And here's Morata. Oh, he's been flattened there. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Looking for the runner. Nice piece. Had a shot. Goal! Spain! And it's Spain who take the lead. Yeah, they were made to pay for not moving the ball smartly enough through a very strong pressing wave. take the lead 1-0 well just listen to the reaction I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium Levaya he's got a side of goal that's a half decent try Levaya just can't be faulted for taking on the opportunity that sort of distance is, is usually up his street Asensio, Carvajal, Spain finding their passes. Oh, easy pickings there. Budimir. No surprise at all that this is the guy who's had such a positive impact. Well, having that sort of... Can he finish? And he comes up trumps again. Levaya clearly thought he'd done enough. The save was like a bolt from the blue. Header! <laughs> and he should have 
have done better, and he knows it. Orsic certainly could have and should have made more of that. Balda. Ferran Torres looks to get on the end of this. The ball is loose and the chase is on. Orsic. Driving on and making good progress. And it's Kovacic. Well time, excellent interception. Forwardson with intent. Gets his pass away. This is promising. Now that's a fine challenge. Kovacic with a definite foul there. Morata. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. the hell nice fist it forward looking for options for movement well it looked promising for a moment but it came to nothing good well that tackle was certainly sturdy Ferran Torres. And there's the end of the first half. Steady, solid, and for now, where they want to be. Just one goal, and they have it. Good effort from both sides, but at half-time, it is 1-0. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Spain having to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. Already up and running for the second half. Spain going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Referee's given a throw. Can he get away here? Modric. Barisic. Orsic. Budimir! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Rodri. Asensio, who does have an assist to his name. Ferran Torres. Ferran Torres! Orsic, and he'll shoot here. No, not quite. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Asensio. And here's Morata. Ferran Torres. And the shot has a goal! Taken with style! Two up and threatening to pull clear! Just 
so calm under pressure and he managed to fashion a fine finish. Well, he had to deal with an awful lot of unwanted attention, but his tenacity won the day. Spain get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. The pressing's intense, and it's paid off. It's out of play, and it is a goal kick. So here comes the substitution. Kovacic. And it's Kovacic. Now this could be a chance. Locks it out wide. What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, he makes those runs with, with great stealth and a ghost-like arrival to get his head to the ball. changes we have been expecting. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they can sense a comeback here and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Now who's going to be first to this? There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Interesting here, Jim, how the defence seems to have really retreated over the last few moments. Yeah, it's impossible to, to keep it up for forever in terms of the pressing we've seen from them. And I think the opposition would eventually have latched onto that and found a way around it. Managed to get it away. Good play on the left-hand side here. Nice bit of skill, and he's away. It's run loose here. Barisic. Oh, that's nice. Croatia really are showing all the necessary urgency, but it's potency they need. Not too much more here than seeing out time, and time is very nearly seen out. Dani Olmo. Spain need to hold on for a few more moments. Swung over. And through to the goalkeeper. Juranovic. Now it's Vlasic, he's got away, so that's it, it is all over.